gorgeous Friday afternoon and couldn't ask for better softball action. How about a top 10 matchup between Tennessee and Stanford? They last met seven months ago. The sophomore with the pitch and Kutsunopoulos check swing there and Kennedy comes in, takes care of business, ends the threat for the Lady Vols. We'll leave the bases loaded, but don't push anything across. Stanford coming. Talk about her in a little bit. The shortstop as this one tagged by Ava Gall goes all the way back to the fence. That's going to score one run. Another one comes across in the bottom of the first. Stanford on the board. Two nil. Nice swing there by the freshman coming from the left side. This is one of those rise balls tailing up in a way, but because she's on the plate, she's able to get her barrel around this outside pitch and drive it out into the right center gap. Hit that one right on the money. Off the now bottom that board the of that center fence, fielder. right field to get Stanford on the board early. Ava Gall who came in with some through 2028. And chasing again, Kennedy pumped up after it. She knows if she can sit down the offense of Juggernaut, it means something. Really settling down. Every time Tennessee seems to get a runner in scoring position, Nigeria Kennedy just shuts it down. A huge strikeout of Kiki Malloy to end that one. A one, two, three inning. The pitch to Rodriguez swung on, sent into left center, giving chase, and Emily Jones tracks it down and comes up with it. Three up, three down, and Tennessee is running low on outs. Stanford up the back of the the home runs and hits and runs that we've seen so far in this tournament. This game was an absolute pitcher's duel. Nigeri Kennedy faced Kiki Malloy in the final at bat of the game, and she comes through with a huge strikeout. Rise ball up and in, directly challenges one of the best hitters in the country with her best pitch, and Nigeri Kennedy comes out on top. 10 straight retired to end the ball game. Handing Tennessee their first loss of the season.